hello everybody welcome to my youtube channel if you are just seeing this face for the very first time my name is anastasia it's well welcome to my youtube channel and if you are a returning subscriber you all are the best thank you so much for tuning in today and in today's video we are going to be talking about a topic like i've talked about this topic before on my channel but i'm going to talk about it again because i've been getting a lot of questions as to this particular topic i'm going to be talking about so without wasting any time let us dive right into the video before we move further into this video i'd like you guys to please give this video a huge thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you have not subscribed to my youtube channel and what i wanted to talk about today guys was um mixing of creams like mixing tubes into creams i've talked about this thing before in one of my youtube videos but i'm going to talk about it again because i've gotten a lot of dms as to this particular topic hmm and some of you guys have also messaged me and you have told me that um anastasia you talk about too much products on your channel you talk about this one today tomorrow you're talking about another one in case you don't know my channel is all about products reviews and skincare reviews that is what my channel is all about and i recently started talking about hair care and wig insulation and all those good stuff okay so my channel is all about products with you so if you see me talking about a product today and i'm talking about another one tomorrow that is what this channel is all about and some of you guys come to my dm and even ask me um and i say please can you try out these products on your skin and come and make a review on your youtube channel okay so that is just what my channel is all about because some people don't tend to get it they feel like i'm trying out too much products on my skin and I don't know if you are genuinely concerned about me or um you get irritated by people trying out different products i i like i don't really know and you don't have to be worried about me like if you are really really concerned about me don't be worried because every single product that i use before i use anything on my skin i am really really sure that um this product is a good product at least you get you get you get what i'm trying to say okay so talking about mixing of creams right <sighs> i've got a lot of questions like oh my, this topic is just something that i just said i was going to talk about today and i have some tube creams with me here today that i am going to talk about because these ones are um tube creams that people have used they've mixed it in their lotions and now they are having issues i reviewed um olibax on my channel a few months ago and in that video i remembered clearly that i said do not mix tube cream do not mix olibats from bat a do not mix those things in your creams and i got this dm from someone actually she told me that um anastasia you destroyed my skin blah 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 and i was like how did i destroy your skin like let me know how i destroyed your skin and then she told me that um i because that was one of my videos where i talked about using nivea i showed you guys my body lotion where is my body lotion yeah this is my body lotion i showed you guys um this body lotion in one of my videos i think that was the video i made before i went to camp i told you guys that this was what i was going to be trying out in that video and the person said the girl said she used this lotion that i talked about that she used it on her skin and now her skin is bad and um she's going to unsubscribe she's going to unsubscribe from my channel that i have destroyed her skin i was like i don't really I don't understand like you can all subscribe on my channel but how did your skin get destroyed by using Nivea and give you show like um the cream gave her pimples it gave her dark knuckles stretch mark and green veins and I was really really wondering how a body lotion as mild as Nivea would do that and I, I went I had to ask her some questions and then she said she mixed guys listen she said she mixed from bat A only baths into a body lotion so that was how um when she told me that then i just knew there is no how in this world that you would use um from back a and use only baths she said she used um one full tube of only baths and then she used one full tube of from back a then she mixed it inside half of this nivea lotion then she was usually on her skin and she was like initially um her skin was getting brighter and lighter and then after two weeks she started having irritations on her skin she started having stretch mark and green veins so she decided to come to me to come to my dm to insult me for talking about nivea 
i don't get if you are using like i've talked about this thing before on my channel i'm going to link um the video i'm going to leave the video in my description box so that you can go and watch that channel i've said countless of times before if you are using a body lotion or a face moisturizer and then you are adding tubes into that lotion you are on your own you are on your own i've talked about it before do not add tube creams into your lotions because these things they are they contain steroids they are meant to treat a skin condition have you ever wondered why they are in small tubes like this have you ever wondered why it's because they are treatment products so i just um i was really really surprised and showed that oh you're the one that destroyed my skin if i if you had not talked about um using nivea she wouldn't have used it i was like madam before you before we end this conversation why did you mix um ole bags in from bacteria into your nivea she said when she was using the nivea guys listen you know, when she was using the nivea that it was um her skin was getting better like her skin was getting lighter um small like bit by bit but it was too slow for her so she needed something that was going to the word was activate she needed something that was going to activate the lotion so she decided to add um these two things and then i told her to go and read about um i told her to go and read about um steroids in lotions and when she went to read um read about it made her research then she came back and she decided to apologize because like i received insults for nothing i don't understand my channel is all about products reviews and i am not the only one on this youtube platform that reviews products many people review products so if you use the products and it's maybe it is slow for you and it did not work for you it doesn't mean the person the youtuber that talked about the product should be blamed i don't get if you want to blame somebody then you should blame the company here yeah? again i remember this one was a few months ago um someone came to my dm and also said um she used the vaseline i recommended on my channel she used it on her skin and um now she has irritated skin and she has this and she has that um let me show you guys the vaseline stuff uh -huh. guys this is the vaseline this one i made um uh, a review about this vaseline in one of my videos where i talked about how i got rid of my dark spots she said she got the Vaseline and then she used the Vaseline on, on her body and then the Vaseline was um was irritating her skin. She was having um she was having reactions on her skin and then she came to my DM to tell me that I shouldn't review products that I am not sure of. I was just like, okay, where are you driving that? I knew that that person must have mixed something into that lotion because there is no way vaseline come on there is no way vaseline would give you stretch mark green vein and destroy your skin Abba. so after asking so many questions then she told me I, I asked her that okay did you mix anything into your vaseline and then she said um she added um skin nail to the vaseline because um vaseline normally makes people dark so she wanted like you know try out a new vaseline so she got this vaseline um aloe fresh um this one and then she got skin nail and then she mixed the two together and she was rubbing it on her body and i was just like <coughs> okay so now you added skin nail to your vaseline you use it on your body now you are having issues then you are coming to tell me i should i should not review products that um i know you should i'm like the vaseline is not the cause of your problem what you are mixing into the vaseline or into your body lotion or into your shea butter is what is the problem and i remembered in my last video where i talked about tube creams i remembered um a mother coming to my dm to tell me that she mixed shea butter and um and from back a for her son and her son is having green veins that she doesn't know what to do and then i was like people really really don't know these things and then you start blaming companies you start blaming skincare brands or, or, and youtubers that film about um that review products for your skin issues when you are you are the one that you know maybe you are not so like you didn't know then you mix something like like i don't get 
so that's why i'm making this video again so that um because most of us genuinely don't know that these strip creams are bad because sometimes we even watch video here on youtube where people will say okay mix tube creams into your lotion to activate the lotion if the lotion is too slow you can add tube creams into the lotion to make the lotion um make you further faster like ugh, i don't really really know so sometimes for me to even go to my um instagram dm to reply dm i'm just like i beg i beg because anytime i go to my dm it's either one person is complaining oh my skin this my skin that and when you find out why their skin is like that at the end of the day it is something they have mixed into their body lotion if you want to really really enjoy the benefits of a lotion use the lotion like that like i, I don't know like that's why i don't make videos on mixing too because i know that th that kind of th i know that it is not good the only thing i have talked about mixing on my channel is mixing um body oils like almond oil into your lotion if you have a dry skin but that's the only thing i have i know i have talked about and using a body oil with your lotion is something that we should even do so that we can have hydrated skin i have never ever 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 talked on this um talked on my channel on how you should mix tube creams or make tutorial videos on how you should make mix tube creams into your lotion haba so um for those of us that don't know i beg you in the name of almighty god please stop mixing tube creams into your lotions tube creams contain steroids and steroids they are not good though they are not good it will start like when you start using it it's going to like give you fabulous results you're going to love love your skin but after after like your skin is just going to go from here to here your skin is just going to be very very damaged so be careful of what you put on your skin if you know you are mixing tube creams into your lotions tube creams into, ah, the one i had tube cream is your vaseline like i don't know like i don't know i know that um we that have melanin in our skin like we, we are prone to hyperpigmentation we are prone to like because we have melanin in our skin and because of the kind of region where we live because if you stay in a region like now we in nigeria we stay in a um hot environment hot and humid environment so we are more prone to like hyperpigmentation and other stuff i know that we want to get a like a brighter skin because most of us are dark and and you know there's no issue with being dark anyways i mean hyperpigmentation issues we want to like clear our hyperpigmentation issues so we end up going extreme like extreme with mixing so many things in our lotion at the end of the day <laughs> It will not end well. There's someone else that um I think that reached me through mail, and then she sent me some of her pictures that she has um serious pimples, and her face is really really bad. I was like, okay, please let me see the your face cream, <laughs> guys. The face cream that she was using was um, um I think lemon 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 vids. I I I'm gonna put a picture on the screen so guys this is what she's using as a face cream as a facial moisturizer she says she has been using it since when she was in secondary school now she's in a hundred level first year in the university and she's she's breaking out guys if you see her face like she has so many people like i actually asked for her permission before even talking about it on my youtube channel i asked for her permission and if you see her face like her face is really really bad her face is really really bad as in she has pimples from her face down to her neck because she was using lemon vase as a face cream guys if you know anybody that uses tube creams skin nail lemon vase epidem um only baths all those tube creams they are good tube creams but they are meant to treat a skin condition they are meant to treat a problem on the skin. They are meant to treat like eczema or like balls or rashes. They are not meant to be used as a permanent um face cream. Like when people mix those tube creams into their body lotions, like I don't I, I don't I don't know. Like it is very, very wrong for you to mix tube creams into your lotions. Like it is so so wrong. If you know anybody that does that, 
even if like right now you are not seeing any um like you're not experiencing any challenge mixing all those things in due time to come guys in due time to come you are going to have reactions and the funny thing about steroids using things that have steroids is that when the reactions come there is nothing that you can do in this world that is going to stop that reaction the reaction has to come out like you have to purge out first before any products can work for you so if you know you are using a tube cream you are mixing it into your body lotion you are mixing it into vaseline or shea butter you are using it as your facial cream i beg you in the name of god this year is ending and we are going to enter 2022 by the grace of god please leave everything this year and when you are entering next year just quit just quit using the steroid now so that you can you, like your face can heal or your body can heal because when you are using tube creams stretch mark <laughs> stretch mark green veins like you're literally going to have green you are going to see your blood vessels you're going to have green veins on your face and for people that use steroids as, as face creams you're going to have like unusual hair growth on you like you're going to see that your face like you start having hairs on your face and then this part of your face is going to be like red and you are going to have like ah like i don't like i don't just know so that's why i'm making this video today because most of us genuinely don't know that these things are bad like tube creams in general they are like prescribed by maybe a pharmacist or a doctor to treat a skin condition people have used um these tube creams because they don't know i don't blame them sha they don't know but now that you're watching this video now that you know you know someone that is doing it please share this video with them it's like i watched a video where um somebody was mixing um a body lotion and the person added hypo the person added hypo into the lotion for people to have like lighter skin and they were selling these products there are so many videos like that where people add hypo to to lotions so that people like so that like you can get a lighter skin tone i honestly like what like um, the thing just weak me the thing the thing honestly is weakening people do these kind of things and then sometimes you will hear people all in the name of organic they sell organic products you go and buy a product you don't know what is inside the product is it not better you use something that you can see the ingredients you can see the formulations you can see everything that they used in the product is it not better you get something like that i don't know why people like do things like that and sometimes these effects of tube creams do not just disappear sometimes the effects are going to last a lifetime it's going to la last a lifetime and not nothing that you do can you know stop it or change it okay so if you know someone that is using tube cream i beg you i beg you please go and tell the person tube cream is not good tube creams are not good they are meant to treat to treat skin conditions not meant to be used to mix inside your face cream or inside your body cream some people will be like ah um what can i use to activate my cream if you want to activate your cream or anything it's not your cream that will do it please please i beg you in the name of god <laughs> okay guys so this is the end of the video i just needed to like tell you guys again because i've made a video about this before please guys be careful of what you put on your skin so that we all can glow like christmas is coming me i want to slay i want to glow so please guys make sure you are careful what you put on your skin i'll see you guys in my next video until then bye